Hi Libra, here's a general look at your solar chart for December 2008. Well this is going to be a sociable, busy, active time. There's probably going to be a lot on your mind, plans, arrangements, schedules, and you may be keeping lists in your head. Some of you could be paper chasing at this time or networking more. Definitely the time to keep your ear to the ground and your eyes peeled seizing opportunities as they arise. Your ruling planets in your home area until the, the um, 8th and this is a, a beautiful feeling of harmony in, in family relationships coming in here. Um, extended family, uh, people in the community, uh, people in your sort of spiritual tribe as well. Um, and a feeling of long distance there, uh, some connection with abroad going on, or perhaps travel. Those of you in search of knowledge, uh, this is a good a period to en engage with others and learn new things. And those of you who feel you have something to say or to contribute to the pool of knowledge out there, then this is a great moment to share your experiences, your wisdom with others. Uh, give of your expertise. Definitely a time for you to be expressing yourself in action. When your ruling planet Venus moves on the 12th, uh, let's say, no, let's just say the 8th, in fact, this is the beginning of a more playful, uh, spontaneous, uh, fun period. Well, in, you'll enjoy the uh, company of children, and animals maybe and also you probably get the chance to party um, or maybe have some romance in your life it's just a sort of feeling uh, of, of, of leisure activity and and of grabbing any chance that you, you have for like entertaining uh, entertainment um, leisure pursuits um, hobbies just just anything that, that helps you feel um, relaxed and 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 enjoying yourself and and playful you may be engaged in uh, more short distance travel at this time and in touch with some uh, new people even uh, communications of all kinds as i said they're strongly highlighted when mercury moves on the 12th into your home area that looks like you're going to be a busy bee right in your own backyard um, until the end of the month your work situation continues to fluctuate. This is a slower moving transit. Uh, unconventional conditions have had a bearing on events um, in the past and will continue to do so. Uh, this could also affect um, your health situation as well, or maybe um, the health of nearest and dearest. There's, there's a feeling of being ambushed by events every now and again. So you have to remain adaptable, and, but also progressive and experimental and unconventional in this area related to your work and to health. That's your own or, as I say, um, those around you. Um, and this is over a number of months. This isn't just December. The feeling here is, as I say, progressive, but, the, you know, temporary disruptions um, will kind of catapult you suddenly into having to rethink aspects of your overall work strategy or game plan um, <clears throat> which could affect work uh, or health and co-workers could cause tension at times or prove unreliable blowing hot and cold you know toing and froing coming and going now you see them now you don't the feeling of uh, things in in your work area um, and this isn't just, the, you know, your professional work. This is your day to day mundane tasks that have to be done at home, um, connected, you know, to just normal, normal living. Uh, but it, it is also to do connected in, in with your professional area, too. Uh, so the feeling of things here is, as I say, you know, uh, you must stay flexible. Um, exp it's experimental. It's not time for consolidating yet. Um, it's time for you to walk your talk to a certain degree, but also uh, to see what's working and, and what isn't and what, what needs to be chucked out, you know. So uh, expect the unexpected in this area here for a while yet. 
now pluto entering capricorn is going to affect librans who were born on the twenty third of the month um so those of you in uh or in fact who have a early libra rising as well you're going to be feeling um the vibration of the planet of death and rebirth the lord of the underworld pluto uh bringing deeper feelings rising up to the surface you know those demons coming up to the surface um uh, things that you've managed to brush quite happily under the carpet before now um you know they're going to start sort of rattling around under there and you're going to have to um square up to to these things and 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 this is all the beginning of this cycle of breakdown change decay death dis you know um dismantling the way things were and then rebirthing into the new time but this is going to be going over a number of months however in this month now you could be feeling um events around you but also feelings inside of you which are which are quite intense quite strong quite emotional about what's going on around you and um this pluto effect will be you know making a lock on your sun or your rising sign over the next uh months from the third week you'll be bonding with nearest and dearest and turning your attention more inward so you'll be nesting then you know those sort of old instincts will start to kick in then and and in fact those old patterns could be raising their head uh, then again particularly after from the 27th of the month and on into january so just be aware of that okay well that's it for december if you know your rising sign have a listen to that too and um you may be interested in listening to your overview for 2009 which will be on here in a couple of weeks